this shop should have been busy with customers, but instead it was drawing firefighters from all over the county as flames took hold. The alarm was raised at 10.30 this morning. The severe nature of the fire in the original factory shop quickly apparent. On arrival, our crews were confronted with a sort of well-developed fire, which was contained within a number of terraced buildings um, between three and four storeys as well. So it's the oldest part of um, Fakenham, and there's a high risk of, um, sort of lateral fire spread as well. It is one of the most significant fires that we've had in Norfolk for, for some time. Fire crews had to lead several people to safety. They said only one person needed treatment for breathing in smoke. No one else was hurt. Two aerial ladders had to be brought in. At its height, a total of 90 firefighters were on the scene. They managed to stop the flames spreading, a challenge in such an historic building. They rely on timber for a lot of the structure, structural support. So what happens is when that timber burns through, um, the whole building becomes vulnerable and at risk of collapse. So um, we've got the safe systems at work in, in place and hence the cordons across the, at the centre of Fakenham so that um, if it does collapse then uh, no one will be put at any risk. The fire sent thick clouds of smoke billowing above Fakenham. They could be seen from 10 miles away. Police closed roads to keep people at a safe distance. Worshippers at Sunday service in the nearby church had to leave while a nearby care home was evacuated by police. The historic shop was home to Aldous's fashion store until 2008, when the company moved to larger premises in the town. Some witnesses suggested the fire had started in a car outside the shop. The fire service say there'll be a full investigation. They'll be at the scene for some hours yet. Vanessa Kemp, ITV News.